Hi, welcome to the virtual tour of our Family Birth Center. My name is Kelly and I'm here to show you around today. When you first come to the hospital, you must check in at one of our two registration desks. If you're coming in Monday through Friday from the hours of 6 a.m. to 4 p.m., you'll be checking in in the front of the hospital at our main lobby right here. If you're checking in after 4 p.m. and or on weekends, you will check in at our emergency location. When you come to the entrance of our Family Birth Center, you will follow the instructions to gain entry into our unit. Our unit is locked at all times. We have surveillance cameras set up at every entrance and exit, and we also have an infant security system in place for the safety of our moms and babies. When you come on our unit, you'll notice our postpartum desk. Directly across from there is our pantry, where you're welcome to help yourself to a refreshment or snack at any time during your stay. Welcome to one of our five labor rooms. This is the basic typical setup of most of our labor rooms. Here we have your labor bed, which goes in a multitude and variety of different positions. We also have different positioning devices, our peanut balls, squat bar, that will help you through your labor. Over here, we have our central fetal monitoring system, and that enables us to keep an eye on your baby at all times. After delivery, baby will go skin to skin with mom for snuggles and bonding. After that period, you will be considered in your recovery phase, where you will stay in this room approximately two to three hours before being transferred as a mother-baby couplet over to one of our postpartum rooms. In the event that you have to have a C-section, our operative delivery room is right here on the unit, just a few feet away. We'll give you a glimpse of that in a minute. As we round the corner of our labor and delivery nurses station, we come upon our antenatal testing room. This is our antenatal testing room. Antenatal is a fancy word meaning before birth. Your doctor may send you over here for some testing, lab work, procedures, non-stress tests, or even a sonogram, and this is the room in which you will come. In the event that you deliver via C-section, our operative suite is located directly on our unit. Although we do practice mother-baby rooming in, there are times when your newborn needs to come to our newborn nursery for a little extra observation. We have a pediatric hospitalist that will be here to take care of your newborn. Our pediatric hospitalists remain on our unit at all times and are immediately available for any delivery and all newborn care. When mom and baby are re finished recovering in labor and delivery, they will be brought over together as a couplet to one of our 12 postpartum rooms. As you can see, our postpartum rooms are very spacious. You will be here for the remainder of your stay, approximately 48 to 96 hours, two to four days, depending on if you had a vaginal delivery and or a cesarean delivery. In our rooms, we have couches for seating that convert to a bed for your support person. We also have TVs available for your educational and entertainment needs, which also have USB ports for charging your phones. While you're here, you may order all your meals off of our Calvert Cafe menu and partake of the specialty coffee bar in the main lobby, all for personal delivery to your room. Prior to discharge, we will be reviewing infant CPR and sending you home with a kit to share with your family and friends. Calvert Health is very proud to be the first hospital in the state of Maryland to initiate this program in the hospital for our community. We hope you enjoyed this virtual tour and we look forward to taking the best care of you and your baby. See you at delivery.